Do you think you can persuade oil producers today to turn the tax on? It's not just a question of uh, looking at uh, the OPEC countries and what they can do to, uh, to increase supply. There's also, uh, as I say, though that is important, uh, there's also the issue of uh, Emirati investment in UK wind farms already huge. Uh, what more can they do? Uh, we need to we need to double the the pace of our of our construction of wind farms. We're already the, one of the biggest producers of offshore wind power in the world. When we look at the the, the dependency that uh, the West in particular has built up on uh, Putin's hydrocarbons, uh, on Putin's oil and gas, we can see what a mistake that was because he's been able to blackmail uh, the West to hold Western economies to ransom. We need independence. But part of your answer to that is to work with a regime like Saudi Arabia. I mean, why are you comfortable working with a regime like that? It has a very questionable human rights record and you've been criticised by many people for being willing to appeal to them. And I've raised all those issues uh, many, many times over the past since I was uh, Foreign Secretary and beyond and I'll raise them all again uh, today. Uh, but we have to, we have long, long standing relationships with uh, this part of the world and we need to recognise the, the very important uh, relationship that we have and the strength of, of that relationship, uh, not just in, in hydrocarbons. This is about investment in the, in the UK over the long term. And